My name is Mason Miller. I'm a senior at Archwood High School, and with me today I have Archwood head baseball coach Jeff Brunswick. Thanks for sitting down with me, coach. You're welcome. So before we start into this season, uh, I first want to talk about how last season ended. We finished 18 and nine. We lost in the district final to Ottawa Hills, and we were co-champs with a six and one record. Very good year. So going along with that, um, obviously group graduates every year so how much of an impact did those seniors have on the team and how well will this year's seniors be able to fill their shoes mason towns was one of our better pitchers last year carson dominic was in left cade was our shortstop creighton kern was our center fielder at 491 and then devin morris um, was one of the better hitters we've had in a long time and obviously every year you lose people and big losses from last year so obviously you got moved to head coach with uh, the retirement of Coach Salgo, but what other coaching staff changes were made in the off season? The coaching staff is pretty much all former players. That's including the summer with Junior Acme and Acme. They're all former players, um, players that played in college. We have a full-time pitching coach working with our pitchers all the time, which has been huge. All right, so now moving into this year, obviously uh, you have a huge group of seniors, is it? What, about 11 seniors? 11 seniors. So how much of an impact does having that much experience have on your team? Veteran, the experience. We have six starters coming back, and it's huge to have that experience, especially in big ball games. So then among those seniors, who would be some of the more key players among them? Jaden would be one. Jaden Silo, he's been pitching, playing since he was a freshman. Uh, Mason Siegel, Brian Burles, Jet Bond. Um, we had Josiah Gomez hit 368 last year, and uh, Stephen Diller be our shortstop. And then how about any key players among the underclassmen? We have some some juniors. We'll have Broden Piercehill, Mike Nostinger. We'll have Cole Becker be our backup catcher. And Jace Castillo, who's a sophomore, is going to do some pitching. So then um, – Going uh, next, how does pre being or having to practice in a gym towards the beginning of the season and even to the start of the regular season, how does that impact your ability to practice? We've been very fortunate to get outside a lot this year. Um, that, not sure. I mean, the weather's been great. We've been outside quite a bit. We've actually scrimmaged outside. But it's a challenge when you go back inside and you just got to be creative. You got baseball is a, a repetition sport and you just you got to keep going. What are some strengths and weaknesses that you see with this team this year? The experience, pitching, and defense. And one area we worked on it today was hitting and bunting. And we need to continue to get better hitting and obviously bunting. Are there any big challenges that you'll face this year? Absolutely. Every game's a challenge. And um, the league is very strong. We have a very tough schedule. We have a lot of you know, D1, D2 schools. We do that to, you know, get guys ready for, you know, the tournament. But the league is very, very strong this year, so it'll be a challenge. So then to go off of that, how do you see yourself and your team in the league standings? Well, every team has, has, a, has a shot. Um, it, many times it depends on who's pitching in baseball. When you go Monday, Thursday in the league, obviously you have to choose which, which game your main pitcher's going, but it's – Every team, every team is going to be a challenge this year, so we just try to get better every day. Are there any uh, key players or key matches that, or games that you guys are going to have in the league? Right, right now, like I said, every every game will be a challenge. But probably, you know, Brian's always a big game. Brian, you got Libby Center, um, Wasion, Patrick Henry, they're all good. And then one more question: uh, What are you most excited for this season? I just I want the kids to enjoy, get better each day, enjoy the game of baseball, being with their friends, enjoy the experience of playing for your for your school. That's very important to me. Playing for Archibald, you get to do this one time, and I want them to enjoy it and just continue to improve every day. All right. Thanks again for sitting down with me today. You're welcome.